Okay, good day guys, good day to you all. Welcome back, welcome back to the Formula Sports channel. Thanks for being here, thanks for being here. So as I'm sure many of you know by now, Jamaica has secured yet another upcoming friendly and this is Jamaica versus the Basque Country, right? Which is scheduled to take place on May the 27th. Um, for starters, I mean, I didn't even know that that Basque Country was a team that, that played international friendlies. I knew about Catalonia, but I didn't know about Basque Country, right? So we'll be playing against, you know, these two particular regions in in spain um a good look for starters a good look first of all the last time i saw the nation playing so many so many friendlies in a short period of time against top quality opposition would have been in the days of winfrey schaefer right i remember there were times in the schaefer era where we had you know a flurry of friendlies in particular international windows for instance which would have been against top quality or, or top quality opposition, relatively speaking. Is this the work of Paul Hall? Is this the work of, of one Paul Hall, of Gaffer Paul Hall, right? Or is this the JFF that needs to take or, you know, should be the one that is given credit for this, right? Either way, you know, whoever is supposed to be getting credit for this, it's a good look. It's a really good look. Um, let me read something. Let me read something that I was uh, I got earlier on. Two friendly, two international friendlies in Spain against Catalonia on May the twenty fifth and Basque Country on May the twenty seventh will offer opportunities to look at new players, mainly from Europe. No, that is that when I when I saw that in a man. I my my eyebrows were raised in a man and, and not in a bad way, just in a, a, a pleasantly, you know, just being pleasantly surprised. I am very, very happy to hear that, right? That you know the main purpose of this friendly will be to to you know offer opportunities to look at new players mainly from Europe. That's a good look. That's a good look that speaks to the fact that Jamaica, you know from earlier on is tapping into its diaspora right and and you know trying to look at new players in its diaspora and give new players in its diaspora an opportunity to strut their stuff for the national team but always complaining about these players coming at the last minute now you know i think you know the the, the, the federation has a has a bit to do with that over the years you know taking too long to you know engage these players and bringing them into the fold far too late and taking too long to sort out documents and all of that stuff right it, it is good to see that a new approach right the, the the federation is going about a new approach under the new gaffa Paul Hall, which is to identify because what is going to happen you know, is that basically Paul Hall wants to look at as much of these players as he possibly can, as early as he possibly can, right, to be able to make a determination as to which ones he would want to work with, you know, going forward, right, whether in the short term, the medium term, or even the long term, right? So they go, they, they go on to say, after they talk about look at new players mainly from Europe they go on to say these new players depending on the assessment of the technical staff could play a role in the short medium or long term plans and meet the objectives of incorporating new players in our roster as early as possible in a new four year cycle guys this is new rhetoric from the federation you know whenever you hear the federation I put out these kind of statements right this is new rhetoric. This is new, you know. This is this is a brand new JFF. <laughs> this is a brand new JFF. I'm joking. I'm not gonna go as far as saying that it is a brand new JFF, 
but I will say that, you know, we're seeing signs of a change of, or I shouldn't say, a, a change in direction, so to speak. Different strategy. You, you know when them say, you do the same thing, who it was, Einstein, you keep on doing the, the, the same thing over and over again, and it's not working out for your definition of madness, so to speak. It is good to see that the JFF is employing a new strategy, right? Identifying these players from the these respective players from the diaspora, bringing them in as early as possible, so that we can build properly to the next World Cup qualifying cycle, right? And honestly, nobody can tell me say and Paul Hall have something for doing this. All of a sudden, Paul Hall's arrival just brings about this this vast change in the way the JFF goes about kickstarting preparation for the next campaign. It can be a coincidence, guys. It can be a coincidence. What I will say is that Basque Country and Catalonia are not joke teams, right? Most of the players that I have seen from what I've been looking at, a lot of the players that plays for these two respective territories are players that play at a very high level. Right, and when I say high level, I mean top five leagues in Europe, guys. Top five leagues in Europe. You see on your screen right there, Inak, I think it's Inaki Williams, you, 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 you pronounce his name, plays at Athletic Bilbao in, in the Spanish La Liga, right? You know, Basque Country, by the way, it's kind of, I think, part of France as well is incorporated as, as well. So, if I'm not mistaken, you will see from time to time players born in France that represent this country from what I am seeing, from what my research suggests, right? You know, it is possible for players born in France as well. But it does appear to be mainly players from Spain, you know, players from, from clubs like Real Sociedad, Athletic Bilbao, you know, um, who else, who else? Ibar, I think, Osasuna, Alaves, those type of clubs, if I'm not mistaken. So, you know, this is top quality opposition we'll be playing against. And what I will say is that these friendlies are going to be a real test for Hall to see how well he can implement his style of play. Right? And also, he's going to be able to take a, a good look at the technical abilities of a number of these players, right, and basically have a better idea in mind, right, as to the, the, the ability of these players to be able to implement on the pitch his respective style of play against credible oppositions. He's going to have a better idea of how good of, a, of, a, of players these players are, these respective, some of these players, especially the new recruits, is going to have a better idea of how good or how capable they are of implementing his style of play against decent opposition, right? Remember these, you know, these Catalonian, these teams like Catalonia and Basque, right? These, these Spanish, these teams with a lot of Spanish players, we all know these teams play a certain kind of way, a certain kind of football, especially Catalonia. And we all know the type of play that Paul Hall himself wants to play, the, the, the particular style of play, right? So he's going to be able to, you know, put some players on the field, right, and go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Basque Country and Catalonia, right, where style of play is concerned. And this is going to be a good test for him to see how well some of these players can match up, right, to these credible teams where, you know, this particular style of play is concerned. You know, putting the ball on the ground, you know, short passing out from the back, pro progressing the ball through the, 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 the thirds, you know, with not a lot of touches, that sort of a thing. Right, in terms of not a lot of individual touches, you know, these Spanish teams they like to, you know, play this tiki taka sort of a, a system of play which includes a certain style of play, right? So, you know, it, it's, a, it's, a, it's a good look, it's a good look, right? I am 
a bit it's gonna be an interesting watch i'll tell you that much it's gonna be an interesting watch i don't know i don't fancy us to to win these games i mean some of the teams that i've seen Basque country and catalonia field are some pretty pretty strong teams man Basque country would have played a costa rica and played the likes of um Munen and played the likes of a williams i mean a number of la liga you know players and la liga starters you know and it looks or it appears as if these two friendlies will have a number of relatively new players in the mix and i don't expect much in terms of from a from a result standpoint but it would it it would be good to see how paul hall himself as a gaffer you know is able to organize his team on the field of play to go toe to toe with these credible teams with these respective styles you know this particular style of play that we all know you know the spanish like to play so guys that's my two cents guys take care stay safe and until next time